Hello everybody, my name is Drew and welcome back to more Pokemon Snakewood. In the last episode, we figured out that Pestilence is pretty much one of the four horse riders, I think they were called, and uh, we figured out that Alicia was actually one of our friends in our life before we kind of bonked our head or something and lost all our memory. But anyway, in this episode, the Pokephone is ringing and we're hopefully going to progress in the story a little bit, so let's see who this is. Huh, who is it? Oh, it's Professor Birch. Hey, Drew, it's me. Listen, I have news for you. I've managed to reprogram an old military satellite, I don't know how, and have got working connection with Doofertown because it is an island. It appears they're completely unaffected by the plague. And what does this have to do with me? I love how we're just, like, not excited at all about anything. But anyway, your brother and May were seen in Doofert a few weeks ago. I don't know how you know this, but that's okay. You should go and investigate. Okay, well, how do I get there? Here's the tricky bit. You need an HM Surf and a Balance Badge to get there. I don't know where you can find the HM, but I know there are a couple of survivors from Norman's Gym. I think they might have a badge or two lying around. Look for them near Rustboro and ask. Okay, will do. See ya, Birch. I love how you call him Birch, but I'll call you later. Good luck! And remember, have fun with it. Uh, if you get that reference, I love you. Anyway... <laughs> I'm gonna go meet you back in Rosbora City, so I will be right back. Alright, here at the northern gate of Rosboro City, we are going to go up here, and uh, now that we have cut, we can actually get through here and see what's behind this tree. Alright, so Lethal, go ahead and use cut. Yeah, I just pointed at my screen like I'm a po real Pokemon trainer, but uh, I'm such a dork. Anyway, there's a super potion there, so if you want that, go ahead and take it. And it looks like we got some berries, and that, uh, I hope that dude's still alive. Uh, we got some blackberries there, and uh, it looks like we're going to have six of them. So pretty cool beans there, or pretty cool berries. <laughs> oh god, that was bad. Anyway, it turned to a soft and loamy state. Let's see. Oh jeez, he's dead. Hey, this dead guy's got a Pokeball on him. Let's see what it is. The Pokeball contained a mad magic card. Really, um, I guess I can't really say no to a po free Pokemon, but then again, it is Magikarp, and it has an item. Uh, wait, what? Let's look at your summary first. Splash, and not really. Uh, I don't know if I want to use this thing, but, whoa. <laughs> Did that just, wait, wait, wait. That was, that was Surf. Actually, you know what? I might keep Magikarp because I'm gonna need someone to use Surf, and uh, we'll we'll see if he can. And um, well, Lethal can. <laughs> um, wait, I'm confused. Uh, isn't Magikarp the water? I guess I guess it can doggy paddle, but uh, whatever. Let's just teach it to Lethal. And uh, Ma sorry, Magikarp, you're gonna be one of those uh, Pokemon that goes into the PC and just kind of gets forgotten. So, I guess we can get rid of Tail Whip, considering that would not be very useful in our quest to stop all the all the zombies. I don't, I don't think we can really Tail Whip them to death, but... Uh, there, there was a... Uh, yeah, I remember seeing a zombie down here from walking up to get the Bluckberries. Um, who do we want out there? You are the highest level, so I'm going to switch you out. And actually, you know what? Let's let's see how much damage Surf will do to this zombie dude or woman, you know. And I'm leaving this battle in. So good for you. A ghost girl, ghost girl Teresa. I know a Teresa. One is in my class at school, but that is not the point. We sent out Lethal, and I probably should have. Crap! You know, I was gonna put John out front, but then I was like, no, it's uh, Lethal. <laughs> So John is going out, and you use, of course you do, <laughs> but then again, this is why I bring some awakenings, so maybe, uh, do I have any that berries that, no, not really, um, where are my awakenings, there they are, okay, we have eight, jeez, okay, um, well, you're gonna use vine whip, that, that's super effective. Not cool, dude. Not cool at all. But uh, we should be able to one-hit KO you, hopefully. Maybe. Please. Nope, of course not. 
Nope, Chuck tossed off, but... Oh, sweet, John, you're amazing. You avoided the attack. Okay, good job. And we're going to use side beam and hopefully finish you off. Please, 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 please. Okay, good, good, good. Good, very, very good. Okay, shrivel sore fainted. We got 241 experience, and... I didn't see what that said. Um... You know what? Now let's switch to lethal. Now let's switch to you. Alright, let's go. Come on, lethal, you got this. I the tiger. Or dog, kind of. Thingy. Okay, whatever. Uh, let's use surf. Surf, because... Yeah, that, that sounds pretty good. Alright, let's use surf. And you can go down. Charm a worm. Charm a worm, yeah, go down. Wow, that, that thing actually looks really cool. I'm not gonna lie to you, that... I wish I had one of those on my team, I'm not gonna lie to you. But anyway, uh, that is not part- 1 HP, really? But I don't think that's gonna, gonna make any difference whatsoever at all, so... We can just tackle you, and yeah, you can go down pretty easily like that. So there we go, we got, we got some more EXP, and we leveled up to level 18, which is freaking sweet! And Ghost Girl Teresa, yeah! Uh, I swear I'm gonna do something at the end of this LP with all the zombie noises, but Glurk. <laughs> yeah, that was so that was so yeah. But what's up here? Oh, a living person! <gasps> I saw them walk, they're living. Holy crap. Um, I did not mean to look at my items. I wanna look at my Pokemon, because she's probably gonna battle us. Considering every single person in the game freaking battles us. Um You know what? Let, let, let's keep lethal out there, I think. I'm the only tra trainer left alive from Petalburg. Well, dang, we found Surf and the survivor from Petalburg Gym. That makes me the gym leader, and means I need to uphold its honor by defeating you. Yeah, you. Wait, what's that from? I don't know, but whatever. Normal girl. That is a bad pun. I'm sorry, that is just a bad pun. But she has Exangus, level 16, I guess. And I'm gonna surf you because surf is a pretty good attack. And quick attack! Dang, that did a lot. Um, and that did not. Okay, well, you can up your attack. Yeah, sharply rose. Two stages or two theme bobbers of attack raised. And don't quick attack. Yeah, just keep doing that. Just you're you're fine doing that. I'm just saying. And uh, I'm just gonna pretend. That you don't have quick attack. Gosh darn it. And is that like an M on Zangus's chest? It looks like an M. I don't even know what that would stand for. Would it stand for Mongoose? No, wait, that would be Gold Duck, wouldn't it? I don't know. Whatever. I'm not I'm not gonna debate on what Pokemon are. Uh so let's send uh, Let's send Pikachu out there. I don't want to send Shroomish out, because I don't want him to get all the experience from this. Um since we got a gym battle here, don't use quick attack. Oh, he's gonna be a sweeper now, isn't he? Shoot, 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 shoot. Okay, okay. Um, let let's go, John. Come on. Oh wait, that's not John. That's Shroomish. Uh, come on, get a leech seed. Get a leech seed. Okay, good, good, good. You're gonna leer. I'm gonna get a leech seed on you, and everything is gonna be okay. Everything's just gonna be great. And you you need to die now. You really just need to die. I do not want to lose to you. That would be terrible. Um, 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 um. Mega Drain, Mega Drain, Mega Drain. No, 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 no. Crap. Oh no. I'm gonna switch to Magikarp to buy some time for Leech Seed. Because I think that'd be the best idea uh, as of right now. I might actually lose this. Wow. Um. Come on, you can do Magikarp Splash! <laughs> Oh, I thought that would work. Um, anyway, John, I'm gonna put you out there, and then I'm gonna heal you up, although I don't know how much good it's gonna do. Please, wait, 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 will this KO you? Oh, don't make me say it. Please don't make me say it. Uh, where are our light potions? Come on, come on, come on, survive, just survive. That's all I ask of you. You're gonna... What? What? Are you... What? Er what? I'm a little confused. Um, yeah, you know, like, say what enough times, like, honestly, but... Seriously, I don't even know what else to say. 
Oh my gosh, and she's gonna... Yeah, that's a she. She's gonna growl us, and that's not really cool, um, because... Well, actually, that is cool, uh, considering I'm using Side Beam. And I like how whenever certain Pokemon growl, they actually use their battle cry, which is kind of cool, but... Oh, uh, whatever. And double slap. Just, just like... Just like a female dog would. Uh, that was a bad, naughty joke, so don't be mad at me. But double slap again. Wait, how does it. How does that even slap you? How many times are you slapping me? What the heck? No! The name of the move is Double Slap. What the heck? I'm. I'm very confused right now. I don't even. I couldn't win. Yeah, you almost did. You. That was just not nice. Huff Puff. Nice conversation. You've earned this. Go on, take it. And we received the balance badge. This is what we need to serve. But now that we are almost dead, I'm going to heal up at the Pokemon Center in Rosboro. And then I'm going to go ahead and go get that item that's below the bridge on whatever route that was by the Pretty Petal Flower Shop. And then I will meet you guys by Mr. Briny's shack. So I'm going to heal up and I will see you guys as soon as we are by the stupid item thingy. But actually that's not stupid. I'm just saying stupid because I almost lost that. And, but anyway, I'll see you guys in a second. Alright everybody, so here by this tree, you can go ahead and cut it down. Yeah, go lethal. Cut down that tree. Yeah, go. And you can get an accuracy plus. That's kind of... That, yeah, that, that, that's kind of disappointing, actually. Uh, and I think in the real game, there's actually something down here. I like how it says, tis water of some sort, will you surf or not? Yeah, like, that's kind of dumb. But, a, a Karamak, whatever that is, I don't even know if that's a real word or if it's made up or what, but, um, let's see what that does. Raises one moves pee pee. Thin chocolate bar, yeah. There's one moves PP, so it's like a PP up, except it's not a nasty name. So, <laughs> yeah, props to you for getting rid of uh, nasty names. But anyway, now I will meet you down by Mr. Briny's amazing hut. So I'll see you guys there. So, anyway, now that we are by Mr. Briny's hut, um, I just tried to get Mr. Briny to take me to Dover because his island zombie can't run running water. But Mr. Briny tried to eat me. Yeah, it happens. Um, but anyway, I think we are going to end things off here. Next time, we will go off this coast and head to Duford City and see if everything's still all right there. So, I will see you guys next time. My name is Drew or Captain Marka, and I will see you guys later.